Good morning, guys. It is Tuesday, May 20th, and I'm more than a little perturbed by Facebook's advertising algorithm. When I was in high school, uh, Facebook had pretty much just become the popular thing to get. The ads weren't very blatant back then. When I turned 18, it was advertisements for all these bars in my area. I wasn't a big partier or a big drinker and I didn't hang out with people that were like that so I just kind of ignored it and went about my business. And then when I turned 21, it was all about, oh, go to Vegas for the weekend, go to Cuba for the weekend, go to Mexico for the weekend. And I was like, okay, so you're essentially telling me to drink but now I can drink and gamble and whatnot in the States. Okay, um, still not a fan, but thanks. Within two weeks of being engaged, I started getting all the wedding ads, got a few good links to some organization websites which really were helpful. That was about it. As soon as you're engaged, win an engagement band! And I'm like, I'm already engaged, I have a ring. This seems a little counterproductive, but okay. A lot of stuff that they were offering, we'd already had figured out. I, li I liked that there was different um, websites to join groups to talk and get information and find people that were also getting married so you can trade information back and forth and I went I don't really want information from people who are currently getting married I want pe information from people who have already been married and for them to impart their wisdom on me because if we're all just kind of in the muck together yeah it's fun but you don't always get anywhere and now I have not been married six months yet. all the baby ads oh my god all the baby ads I haven't been married for six months yet. Can I enjoy just being married to my husband? Do I need to start thinking about children right away? I'm 24 years old. I've got time to have kids for crying out loud. And yes, okay, one of my friends right now is pregnant and I'm super excited for her. She's also almost 30. Like she had her time to go to school and establish a career and you know, have a good few years, just her and her husband together. And that's awesome. And that's what I'd like. But holy cow, all the baby ads. And this is the kind of where I'm getting to. I am kind of not shocked, not really surprised, just intrigued by the amount of people in my circle of friends that do not want children. They don't want to get married. They don't want to have kids. That does not interest them in any stretch of the imagination. They're, they're comfortable being single or living with their common law partner indefinitely. They, they don't care about any of that. And that's fine. Facebook needs advertising to reflect that because not everybody wants to get married, have 2.5 kids, and live in a house with a white picket fence. That's not everybody's dream. It's not even my dream anymore. <laughs> TLDR, Facebook, oh my god, stop sticking me in a box and shoving advertising at me that I don't want. Use your site for what it was designed to to figure out what people share your common likes and interests and give me ads that support that. Mind-blowing idea. I know, right? Anyhow. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Have a beautiful day.